so hey everyone welcome back to my channel so in this video i will tell you two mid journey alternative that you can use to create ai images for free so you might be curious what are those two sites so watch the video till the end to get to know what are those sites so without wasting further more time let's get started so to use those tools we need to first open google chrome and here type microsoft image creator uh, yeah you heard that right it's come from microsoft itself so click on the first link and this is the website where you can find all of the images and you can generate as per your need so first join here and you will have to enter microsoft account details in order to proceed further and if you don't have any microsoft account simply just create an account so i just here sign in in my account and after that the interface is look like this there are some sample images that you can follow up and on the right side you can see a boost option what is this mean it means that whenever you use this boost your image creation is a bit faster and you, if you don't have any boost left then the image creation is a bit slower so let's first try a prompt over here so i have just entered my first prompt and let's create as you can see on the right side whenever i just create any images the boost section will reduce by one so right now it's creating the image for me so as you can see see as per my prompt the image is generated successfully so let's try something else so for your simplicity i just have copied some of the prompt over here so yet it's create that efficiently as per my prompt so that's a thumbs up for microsoft so as you can see on the top left image creator powered by dali what is that mean it means that microsoft has signed a deal with open ai that's why dali feature is integrated with microsoft let's try a last prompt let's see how efficiently it can generate so this image creation is not up to the mark as you can see here the image is bit blurry and not in detail so on the right side you can see when i have just started my creation it is on 24 but it's now reduced to 22 whenever you just create an image it will reduce by one and if it is reduced to zero then also you can create images but the image generating is a bit slower and if you like any kind of images you can simply download it from here let's move on to the next site so the next site that i am going to talking about it's lexica here this is the interface of lexica as you can see on the bottom side there are so many images that are already generated and as per your need you can download it from here also and if you don't want this kind of images you can use your own prompt to generate your own images as i have already copied some prompt for you to generate the images faster let's try our first prompt let's see how efficiently it can generate that image for me or not just search it over here so it generate that image for me and you can also generate as per your description over here here just like this so it's currently analyze my prompt and as per my prompt it will generate that image so it's currently generate that image for me if you like any kind of images that it has generated you can simply upscale these images if you want and if you want to download this image you can simply drop down this arrow and download it from here so let's say i want to upscale this image so how to do it just simply click on the upscale button and right now it's upscaling the image for me so here you can see that the image is upscale drastically so as you can see here image detail is very efficiently upscale as compared to the previous images in this way you can upscale your image as per your choice so you can also generate images as per your requirement like i want the images in landscape mode just drag this option and you can choose images as per your requirement so let's say i want an image in landscape mode so generate it so it's generate that image in landscape mode also so let's say i want to upscale this image just simply click on the upscale button so here you can see the images upscale drastically as compared to the previous images so in this way you can upscale your images so let's try another prompt so right now it's generating that image in the landscape mode but i want this image in portrait mode so just drag this option and generate again so see how efficiently it generate that image for me and it's not looking that an ai is generated that image it's like a painter is painting that image what you say so that's it for this video if you like this video give it a like and if you're new to this channel please hit the subscribe button and press the bell icon so you will never miss any important update like this in the future videos and if you like this video please share this video with your friends so i will see you in the next one until then bye bye